Take two. <laughs> she had white stuff around her lips. <laughs> Where'd your feet go when you seen the snake? Up along... on the highway bus. <laughs> it was coming towards us. Good. Yeah, yeah, guys, that's a king size bed. Make, she makes it look small now, doesn't she? <laughs> Better of you than that. I would do it, Paul, if it didn't cost $550. Aren't they? And this is our... Oh, my fucking God, babe. What's she doing in there? Let's get out, we can leave this city. Let's drive to the open air. Yeah, the countryside is so pretty. With the wind blowing in your hair. We can look back someday. Okay, so we're down in Coffin Bay. Aren't we, my darling? We might get off and just go for a little bit of a walk here, maybe. <laughs> Don't Take use two. it. Take two. <laughs> she had white stuff around her lips. <laughs> <laughs> white stuff one person would be hoping for. Sunscreen. <laughs> On a day like yeah. today. Okay, mm. we have pulled up down at Coffin Bay. And we're down at the jetty slash wharf whatever Kim wants to call it. So we're going to go for a little walk around. It is a pretty little place, isn't it? It is. It's pretty good, isn't it? Hey, look, 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 look. This is Coffin Bay. We can go out for a walk out on that jetty and we'll see if anyone's catch any fish. Yeah. They might be bringing crabs ashore, babe, on that boat. Yeah. What's that big thing on the end of the jetty? Uh, that's a fueling place, I reckon. Wow. Yeah, for the I've boat. never seen that. There's a four-knot limit here. Well, Kim ain't going to go past that, I can tell you, not while she's walking. <laughs> <laughs> not on the bike, even. What about area, is it? Hmm. They're either crab pots or they're bloody crayfish pots or something on that boat. Yeah, they're like the ones yeah. that we've seen. Yeah. Yeah. Okay, then, so we'll just look in there. Some little kids, that family down there, they're catching some little whiting, aren't they? Yeah. More than what we've caught in the boat. <laughs> Usually when we go fishing, we don't have much luck, so we go back drinking, don't we, sweetie? Yes. Mm -hmm. Yeah, normal. When the words Coffin Bay are uttered, most people think of oysters. Coffin Bay and Coffin Bay National Park are a central part of an isolated, unspoiled South Australian holiday destination on the Eyre Peninsula. They are designed for people who want to spend time fishing, sailing, skin diving, water skiing, bushwalking enjoying themselves on the beach and messing about on the bays and on the waterways in boats. G'day, g'day, g'day guys. We've rolled up for another night here at Port Lincoln. Oh, actually, it's the second night, isn't it, sweet? That yeah, is. it's the second night. Um, we didn't film them well. We did a little bit of filming on the first night, but not much. But I thought we'd just show you around our little unit in our complex, eh? Yep. We have, this is Sunday morning. We've been out to Coffin Bay and back already, haven't we? We have. Um, not a bad little place. A little bit overcast out there today. But guess where we go tomorrow, guys? Streaky bye. Someone's going to be streaking all of it. <laughs> oh, and tell them about the. We what? seen um, an emu on somebody's front lawn. At yes, the coffin. out of coffin. Yep. Yes. And a snake coming towards us on the road. Middle of town in Coffin Bay, this big emu just blocking yep. away at their front lawn, wasn't it? Looking for worms, probably. And a snake wanted to You thought that. Where'd your feet go when you seen the snake? Up on the highway bus. <laughs> he was coming towards us. Yeah, but he was still bloody eight feet away from us. It was on the you, other mate? side of the road, yeah. like on yeah, the middle of the road. black colour, probably a brown or so. I don't know what it was. Mm, it was the dark one. Who knows? Who knows? But this is our little abode for the night, isn't it, babe? Yep. That's my babe. This is the love nest. Get on the love nest, babe. Get, Get on, on the love on the nest. Love nest. Show, them, show them how small the love nest is now <laughs> since we've been on all yeah, Don't guys, you go look it up, my skirt. Yeah, yeah, guys, that's a king size bed. Make, she makes it look small now, doesn't she? <laughs> king size. <laughs> but we're number 32 and we're staying at the Hilton. There's the babies there. And um, it's not, not a bad sort of day out here today. And there's the water down there. What are you doing? 
I'm just looking up this sort of stuff. As if you're gonna go diving with the sharks. Shark Paul cage. Kilby. Paul Kilby said to me. Shark cage. You're full of talk and he's lost all faith and confidence in you now. Really? That's what he well. said, yeah. You're all fucking talking. I would do he it. He thought better of you than that. I would do it, Paul, if it didn't cost $550. No. She's full of shit, Paul. Full of shit. So this is our little fridge. Yes, they always hide the fridges on us, don't they? And this is our... Ca oh, my fucking God, babe. What's that doing in there? What is it? What's that thing doing there? What's that? Uh does that, go with, does that go with your morning cuppers, does it? That must do, yeah. <laughs> this little <laughs> thing gets she around. Likes, she likes it in the morning. <laughs> <laughs> this gets around, I can tell oh, you. Oh, dear. There's our mess here. Yeah, that's our bag. Oh, babe, what's that thing it's doing another there? another one. <laughs> <laughs> what's that? Oh, got another one. Got it uh, everywhere. So this is our shitter here. That's our shitter. The bloody... The shower! Oh, I forgot for a minute and I'll ask you is respect is earned. Loyalty is returned. In the boat. Yep. Respect is earned, loyalty is returned. I read that backwards in that mirror. Oh, you're pretty smart. Yeah, that's what I thought. There's our sink and everything. But we're um this like I said, this is the second night here tonight, and we're off to Street Cube tomorrow. We could be getting a bit of bad weather Wednesday, Thursday. Rusty thinks he's gonna see streakers. Well, why else would they call a streaky bay? I don't know, babe. Nothing, well, I'm not going then. Nothing to do with the bloody wildlife or the fish or anything, is it? Well, I'm not going. <laughs> if there's no streakers, okay. I'm not going. There is no need to. There will be when we get there, though. Where? Where? Streakers at Streaky Bay. Where? Whereabouts? It'll be us. <laughs> <laughs> Couple of fucking beach whales, I reckon. Oh. That's about it. Hey, then, guys. Better go. But um, things do, people say places to go. We're about to go out for a spin around town in a minute and have a look at a few lookout points and everything. Tuna Farm Cruises Bay, Billy Light Point, Shark Dives, <laughs> Shark Bait Kimmy. <laughs> shark Bait? Yeah, yeah, Shark Bait Kimmy. Alright, so we're just touring around Port Lincoln at the moment. We decided to come out and have a bit of a look, didn't we? We've done our washing, we've done our drying, we've done our ironing, haven't we? We've done our daily duties, so yes. we're allowed out. Yeah. Tennis court there, if you feel I'm fit, babe. I'm not. <laughs> <laughs> I'm honest. Yeah, I suppose so. I feel skinnier because my clothes are tied on me. Yeah, that's because they just come out of the dryer, though. <laughs> that's always a good feeling. Feel like you've lost weight then. Or no, yeah. you feel like you put weight on, actually. It's not a very uh, good feeling. Uh, yeah. Uh, no. <laughs> <laughs> North Lakes Bay, well this is a bit posh for us. Oh. Look at the place. Yeah, it's just fancy. Yeah, nah, fancy dancy this one, isn't it? A lot of a lot of tuna yeah. fishermen own these, I reckon, mate. Yeah, they've got <laughs> tuna on their mailboxes. Yeah, that's right. <laughs> they got their fancy mm. pants on. Oh, look at the boats. Whoa. Look at them all. All the big tuna boats and that. Tuna wharf rock. Rockwell Lobster Wharf. We could have went down there. Oh. We we'll come do. back around there. There's a few million dollars worth of friggin' boats there. Prawn oh, Wharf. Okay. We'll go yeah. down around there, babe. Oh, we'll have a look. We can only oh, get have... kicked out. Yep. Someone might have some rock lobsters we can look at. Not open. Fuck, I was going to go in the dive cave today, too. You can put your head in that shark there. Yep. I'll put your head in there when we come back. I'll, I'll send it to Paul Kilby. Yeah. <laughs> shark on her, mate. <laughs> oh, shark bait. Yeah. Okay. So look at this, will you guys? I'll just take you across and I'll just show you. Look at them. Oh, yeah. Look at all these boats here. There's millions of dollars worth of boats here, isn't there, babe? She's a ripper. Ripper, ripper. Ripper. I don't know, I think these ones here look... If you get me on a boat, I want something big like that. Like this one? These ones here are bigger. Yeah, but it's not as big as the Spirit. You're gonna, you're gonna get sick. Uh. Hi then. The Port Lincoln Marina is situated approximately five kilometres from the town centre and is a hub of the commercial fishing fleet. Here, you'll find the largest commercial fishing fleet in the southern hemisphere, with prawn, tuna, mussel and lobster boats docked in the marina. 
During tuna harvest, you can watch the boats unloading the cats, always an impressive sight. Hey then guys, so this is all down around and near the marina area. We're just having a little bit of a look around, aren't we babe? Little look see. We'll go out here and have a look see. That's the other end where we just were. See the tuna coming off in the net, you have a look babe. You watch them lift them off in a sec. Yep. So we're currently down at the wharf and they're unloading some tuna boats. I, I hope my tyre pressure. What, babe? Just checking my tyre yeah. pressure. Well, you, you went into it accidentally. No, I'm <laughs> checking it. Okay. 36.5, 42.5. So, if you can see down there, guys, they're unloading the, the tuna. tuna. Down in the hole of the boat there, babe. You watch him lift it out in a sec. Here we go, babe. They're lifting some out now. Okay? I thought they were, thought they were bigger. That's a nice little catch in the babe for you. Yeah. Straight in the tub, babe. Marvellous. Whether or not that come from a tuna farm or not, who knows? So they just wash that and the water goes out underneath the, under the tubs. Oh, look at the boat. Yeah. Kim's amazed. Tubs they have. One, two, three. Oh, they've got more on the back. Are these oh, full yeah. of tuna? Yeah, yep. They sure are. They put plastic around the top there, the, the ones that are wrapped up are already got tuna in them. So with the plastic on the top, on the on the ships, on the boat, yep. uh, on the trucks I should say. Yeah. 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 So they must be in a bag in there too. Yeah, okay. Very good. So this is the other side of the wharf area guys. There's one called Kylie Port Adelaide. Oh, Kylie would have a good bloody figure on her, wouldn't she? Violet. Aislinn. They're all girls' names. Probably yeah. their wives. They normally are girls' names, folks. I'll take you down there. People have got their own docks. That's their own dock. Private dock, babe. Yep. You have a look all the way along here. This is where the money is, sweetie. Yeah. You need to get into tuna fishing. <laughs> yeah, you think? See that? Use me, use me for bait. Up the canals there. Pretty nice, eh? Look at that. Fake lawn. Who want fucking who wants to mow your lawn when you can be out there fishing? Keep true. Hey, don't go over the edge, babe. Oh um, what are you doing? But didn't you come down with me? Hey. No. Why not? I'm getting ready to do a evil can evil. Yeah, where you go. I thought you were right behind me when I was talking to you. Uh -huh. You should have seen them down there. I did see him from the other side. Oh, okay. Okay, Kimmy, so where are we going today? Um, Streaky Bay. <laughs> oh, lovely, I love it. Rusty. You've got to talk a bit louder because the mic's in there. Rusty thinks there's streakers in Streaky Bay. Also, so we're just at Mackers at the moment at um, Port Lincoln. Yeah, that's the one. I've been on the road that long, I've forgotten where we are most of the time. Show so around. We'll, we'll catch you down the road. We'll just have a bit of break. Just a hand or two's toast. So. Okay, then, goodbye to Port Lincoln. Last two nights here. Uh, it's been fun, isn't it, babe? Yeah. Yeah, it's a nice little town. So we're heading um, 
But we had uh, out the streaky bay to have a look. Now we're going to get caught in some rain next couple of days, I think. So it's going to be challenging, isn't it? Because there's going to yeah. be a bit of wind with it too, I think. We'll see what happens, eh, babe? Yeah. We'll be right. We've done that before. Yeah. Glue all the pieces back together. Yeah, you. You take all my wrongs and make them better. Yeah, you. You're making me wanna try forever I feel so free Oh my sweet baby